Hey folks, this is Decoherent, and welcome back to There Are Billions. So, a couple things as we start off here. Um, yes, I've had this turned off for a long time. I forgot about that sawmill. Sorry about that. So, um, planning-wise, so I have a number of things going on here that are distinctly suboptimal. Um, <laughs> you may have noticed I wasn't necessarily planning very well ahead. Um, in particular, probably some of these power plants should not be there. I probably should be using farms all in this area, this nice grassy area. But in my defense, I wasn't thinking all that carefully, so that's kind of what's happening. So, um, we are going to end up with a lot of power plants because my plan is to put shocking towers everywhere. Just everywhere. Um, we're long past the point where single target and even small group defenses are very useful. We need to just exterminate everything, I guess. That sounded dumb when I said that out loud, but that's actually really kind of what the plan is. So, um, we're going to keep doing things like that. Um, I would love to have multi-layered defenses. It really doesn't look promising. Like, if they get through some of these, you know, I can leave these old walls up and stuff, but, you know, by the time these all multiplied into zombies, we're basically done. So, <laughs> uh, nothing to worry about there. Okay, so, um, up here, I need to put in more, um, let's see here, there's actually a spot here that doesn't have any power. Check that out. And I need that because that's where I want to put another lumber mill. Because we're just going to keep putting those everywhere. Because we just need all the lumber. Um, we can get 14 here... That's going to be our final one from that side, but that's okay. We can get 14 there, um, we can get 11 here, and then I think we can get another 14 there. Oh, actually, I don't need that tower, do I? Well, it doesn't look like I do. If I can get a 14 and the 11, well, heck, isn't that great? Well, never mind. Cool. Um, anything else? Oh, yeah, I can fit one more stone core down right here for five more. So we'll go ahead and we'll do that. We're just going to need it. We're going to need everything. Um, my next thing I need to build is the foundry. All we really need is 3,000 gold, and that should show up pretty quickly here. I've got the train coming in three hours. I think I'm going to have all of these done. Maybe. It's going to be close. Come on. Give me the population and all their money. And... Yes! Alright, good deal. So now we have lots of population, and thus lots of money. Um, I can actually put another bank in somewhere, and I haven't decided if I'm going to do that or not. I've got one... Well, here... Um, and I've got one down here. The question is, do I want to monetize these people in the middle? Well, the answer is obviously yes, I do. Where would I put it, though? It's not really a good spot. I'd have to knock down at least one or two houses. Probably... Probably all of those houses, actually. All four of those would have to go. And that wouldn't be ideal, that's for sure. Or over here, or down here, or something like that. So, um, we'll see. Oh, I suddenly have enough money. Okay, so where do I want to put the foundry? Um, not any place where I'm going to be building anything like a farm. Let's look for empty spots. You know, I couldn't fit in any more gold over here. So let's just build the foundry here for no particular reason. Go ahead and do that. And then in the meantime, um, have I started up shocking towers? I have not. Let's wait for that to tick. Um, in the meantime, we'll kind of work on walls because we need, you know, lots more walls. Um, good. Next quarry is done. Unfortunately, I did this kind of the wrong direction out here. Ah, uh, that's right. I have to take these stupid things down. God, these are annoying. Take it down. Take it down. Sorry about this, guys. Don't worry. You'll have your spots back in just a minute. Or am I just dumb here? It looks like I'm just dumb. I wonder why it let me build those two. Well, okay. So, that was my bad. Um, but still, I'm not going to rebuild those towers quite yet. Because I want to see what I'm going to need. And it won't let me build anything here. I think I can build a stone tower here. But this is going to be a real weak point right there. Because it won't let me build there for any reason. Or out here. <laughs> it keeps saying like, ooh, three layers are not allowed. It's like, well, but I don't have three layers. So, there. Anyway. I love watching this like 1500 tick. That's so great. That's just, that's so wonderful. I love it to death. Alright, so, walls. Just everywhere. Now, the one area, or actually, rather, the two areas that really have me worried are my two main entrances over here. Now, over here, if I felt like it, and I probably do, I can box this in to put a second entrance. Over here is a little trickier. Um, I would have to probably knock down this farm, and I'd have to build something kind of like this. That's not a good area the way I have it set up, unfortunately. Um, and I wish I hadn't done it like that. But unfortunately, I did. And so that's kind of where we are at the moment. So, tragic but true. Um, I have a lot of food, and I forgot to make some tents. I was so focused on building walls and stuff that I completely forgot. 
which is still something I want to do. You know, there's still room for lots and lots of walls, and I intend to use all of them. All right, so it looks like um, I can get a couple more over here before I start interfering with where the oil is going to need to be. Yeah, it's telling me I can't build there. Okay, so is that about it then? Nope, a few more over here. Good God, you can fit a lot of houses in around this one. And another whole layer down here. Did I just run out of money last time, or why did I stop building these? Now, is that it? Basically. Okay, good. That'll be good for tomorrow. We're already at 1300 out of a required 2000 so that's okay. Um, okay, the foundry is done. Good. So now that means I can start going ahead and getting oil. Okay, well, it's quite expensive. There we go. Um, is there one that's better protected? Not really. They're both kind of at the extreme. So, okay, just put this one there. We'll just start accumulating oil. But that's not actually what we need. What we need next... Huh, now we need to build the engineering center for another 2,000 gold, and then we can actually start training things. And we could actually get the advanced mill, ooh, and the advanced farm. Interestingly, I don't think we need them at this point. We will, but not at this exact point in time. Let's keep on making these walls thicker and thicker. You can never go wrong with making walls stronger, right? Looks like it's just on the diagonals here and there that it's letting me put them in. And that's fine. I, I honestly don't know why it's letting me click on some of these spots and not on others. It's kind of funny. Which is why I'm just kind of clicking on things to see what happens. How about out here? Can I build more walls out here? Oh, I'm out of resources. Never mind. Even with all these things going, it's not enough. Um, while we're building resources, let's just go ahead and let's keep working on these iron mines. Because I can fit a lot of these in. Well, okay, maybe not quite as many as I'd hoped. But I can fit in a good number of them. Do I need that much iron? No. Not really. But I want them. Okay, so let's see. I forgot how much shocking towers cost. Shocking towers, 30 stone and 600 gold. Ugh. So that is why I want all the stone in the world. Okay. Okay. And I do need to build my own wasps. But we'll get to that. And I need to research the engineering center. So I just need money. Lots of money. Please give me money. I'm going to hold on to those for a little bit. We just need to survive the next wave, and I've only got seven days to prepare for it. Um, and last time's defenses are going to be utterly, completely inadequate. In fact, you know what? I should really be spending this money on shocking towers. So where can I put them to completely trivialize some of these entrances? Like, we have these little short areas that don't have anything there. That a shocking tower would just exterminate everything. I'd love to put in two here. I don't think I can. Yeah, I could put, well, no, but I could put one there, and I could put one over here if I felt like it. Okay. It would help a lot if I knew which direction the next wave is going to come from. But like I said, there is going to be shocking towers just everywhere. So, let's build one here. Then that's basically all I need for defenses. There we go. And let's put... Now yeah, that's going to need two. That's going to need two. This only needs one. Uh-huh. Ooh, these things are expensive. And they use a lot of power, too. What is it? Uh, 20 each? Yeah. Oh, we're out of power. That's another reason why this isn't going to work. Maybe I should research the advanced power plant. Hmm. Attention. Building completed. Oil platform's up. Yay. Attention. Alright, good. Snipers are up. That's nice. Boy, this map is really starting to build up. Like, wow. Okay, here we go. Another power plant. Um, It's hard to find spots where I'm completely confident I'm never going to need them. Like, actually, over here, I checked. These would make crappy farms. So we can go ahead and just put that here, and that'll be fine. And did I build all the lumber mills that I was talking about? There, 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 yeah, okay. And there. Ah, it looks like I didn't put some down here yet. There's a 9, an 11, a 14, yep. Okay, good. Very good. Like I said, power everywhere. And stone, I may actually end up spending money to buy stone, wouldn't that be weird? 
I mean, I can't at the moment, but I could at some point in the future. Alright, here's our first shocking tower. Hello. Shocking towers are cool. I like them quite a bit. I wish they weren't quite so expensive, but that is the point. Come on, power. Um, this is not going to be enough. Let's build a second power plant. Can I put it right next to each other? Yeah, there's no reason not to. Yeah, just put it right there. And that's why I need 115 um, per turn. <laughs> I mean, I could research the mills. That might actually be the most useful thing to do at the moment. I mean, I can't even use all of our, my gold at the moment. I'm just promptly capping. And I don't have any power to build anything, so it doesn't really matter, you know? Oh, I wish I knew what it was I needed. Wish I knew where things were going to come from. Because there'll be this wave, and then there'll be one more wave after that. That's where it's, And that's what's going to happen. So, okay, so... That area is kind of well covered. How about down here? This area is not covered at all. Basically. Could I get away with just one, I wonder? Just to keep the middle clear? You know, I'll bet I could for a lot of these. Not the ones where I've already put ballistas, but some of the others. Where it's like... I don't know, just a tower, for some reason. Like, come here guys. I'll give you your tower back, don't worry. Your tower is going to be awesome, because it's going to be right next to a shocking tower. And at the moment, it's just going to be wood. Because that's what we can afford. So, there you go. <laughs> And up here, it's kind of the same thing. It's like, if I build these kind of like this, then that does leave the edges um, a little exposed, but, you know, it'll take out so many bad guys that it'll let my existing defenses handle that, which is kind of what I want. And I'm just building wood towers, like I said, because um, I need my stone for other things. Cleaning your weapon, huh? Whatever you say, man. And I should probably be also training soldiers at a huge clip. Um, I have not been doing that in kind of a while. Um, oh, and snipers. Yeah, let's train a bunch of snipers. I forgot about them. That's not great. You need protection with snipers. Okay, another power plant is up. Very good. And we're about to get some more stone. So let's put another shocking tower up here. This area is exposed enough, I may want to put in two. This area is exposed enough, I may knock down this ballista. And then put another one over here. That's wasteful, but I think I'm going to do it anyway. Because that will make that area a lot safer over there. And then I can put another one right there. Yeah, I think that's the plan. Yep, that's the plan. Alright, so... Um, I should probably build a second soldier center, because I'm going to need to really crank out soldiers, so let's just put another one in. Um, it doesn't actually matter where. Here, just go, just go here. That's not a place I can actually put a farm anyway. Speaking of which, I should probably just preemptively start building these. 65, great, cool. Go ahead and build it. 234 power. And we have our first sniper, hello. Welcome to the team. I don't know where to put you yet. But I will decide that soon. Where, now, where are you mustering? I've already lost you. <laughs> Why don't you guys muster over here? There you are. How about you come over here? Because I will need your help over there. And yeah, and then we'll just kind of work around the opposite direction here. And as we get our stone showing up, I will go ahead and I will just keep building shocking towers. And that will protect this side. Yes. And then next we're going to want to deal with this area. And I may have to do the same thing. I may have to knock down at least one ballista. Attention. Building completed. Actually, maybe not. We'll find out. Come on, tick. Hurry up. Thank you. What can I do over here? Can I put it right there? Oh, I can put it right there. Okay, that's fine then. Let's do that. And you know, I actually haven't been building any of my spike traps yet. I should just be doing that. They're pretty cheap, right? Yeah, they're cheap. Let's just throw some in here. They slow the waves down initially, so it's like, eh. They don't do a ton of damage. But they slow things down a little. And sometimes that just gives you just barely the edge that you need, so it's good to have it. Okay. Still doing grid on power. Alright. 
And let's just keep moving you guys around. And I'm just going to keep snipers queued up. I'm just going to keep this one running snipers and this one running soldiers. Yeah, we're getting some big waves up here. Ugh. Alright. Let's muster you guys in the same place. Just so I can find you. Yeah, this is... Huh. Yeah, okay. 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 So, now we've got two up here. Um, one coming in down there. Yeah, I'm gonna have to knock one of these blisters down. Bah, that sucks. Probably this one. Yeah. It's worth it, though. We need the AoE damage. Okay, so where does not have one? Um, neither of these places have one. Same problem after we knock these blisters down. Ah, that hurts. That just hurts deep inside. Wasting that kind of resources, but it is objectively better. Or better placement, rather. These have to be right in the center. Um, and I should have thought about that during my initial placement. And that was just poor strategy on my part. Alright, next sniper. So I've got one over here. Um, why don't you come up here? And I'm not totally sure what to do with all the extra, like, soldiers. We're just gonna put them in random places, I guess. We'll just fill up these various towers. I, I don't I don't know. Why are you asking me? What do I know about anything? I'm terrible at this. Okay, we've got just a few more days. I have enough money once again to build every um another shopping tower. Still doing okay on power. Um I can try to come back and like infill this with ballistas. They can't be too close to each other, but you can actually put them in here. So I probably will. Looks like this can be here. And you, poor guy, I took away your tower. And that was a very tragic time, so how about you get a new tower right there. And over here, too. Wasn't there a guy with the tower? Yeah, there was a guy right there. He had a tower. And now he doesn't. Any orders? And he's visibly sad to me. So, there we go. Okay. I could use some soldiers down over there. Sniper is ready. Alright, sniper. See, I think I've got one coming over there, so why don't you come up here? I'm going to set all the towers, of course, to highest target, rather than, you know, nearest. Because that's going to be the way to do it. I like having all these shock towers coming online. That makes me feel good about myself. Once I've got one at every opening, I feel like I'll be ready to take things on, you know? Like, then, then we'll be good to go. We don't yet, but we're getting much closer. Okay, right here is going to be another problem. Oh no, never mind. I can just fit it right there. Okay. So what are we going to do about this entrance? I have to tear basically everything down here to make this fit. Basically, this whole farm's got to go. Disappointing, but true. I mean, we can still get benefit over here from this warehouse, but now this is not in the best of all possible places, because yeah, this has to come out. If I'm going to build any reasonable defenses, um, this power is also in the wrong place. It's in a bad spot. So, it's just going to be, it's just going to be a mess. I'm just going to have to take this out and just rebuild that entire area. Over here, I don't think I need to get quite that carried away. Um, I wish I hadn't put that wasp right there, because I could just put another line of walls in here, but Let's not worry about it quite yet. Okay, good. Next sniper. Where are you at, buddy? So I think I had one of you coming up here. Let's bring you over here to this brand new tower. And you can hang out with this soldier. And the same over here. And, oh, you're all by your lonesome. But that's okay, because this is not a real entrance. These are kind of neat, because you can kind of shoot, but they're not, like, getting directly at you. And I like that quite a bit. Alright, so... Am I going to put another shocking tower down here or not? That's the real question. Because I've got the one here. I could have spaced them out and put them where the blisters are. That would have been a great plan. But I didn't. Why? I don't know why. Dare I take all this down? <sighs> okay, I'm going to need you all to pretend that you didn't see anything in that little bit that I just fast-forwarded through, okay? Because if you would have seen anything there, 
It would have been this shocking waste of resources. And that would have just been... That, that would have hurt deep inside to have seen something like that. So go ahead and continue to have not seen that. Um, I think I'm going to start actually just upgrading houses. I think that's actually going to be a little quicker than expanding outwards. I mean, I have lots of workers. Oh, um, did these queues run out? No, they didn't. Okay. Let's keep them full. And even though I don't quite have a place for you guys, just come on down here. I can almost use snipers and everything else, so just keep keep showing up. Okay, so for down here, I think I'd like to do something similar. I think I'd like to put in two. I put one here. And then I can put another one in over here, even though it doesn't look like it. Okay, next sniper. And you're gonna come... here. Reporting for duty. It is going to be so hard to get the guy, these guys spread out correctly. Like, I don't even know what I'm going to do. I'm probably going to have to pause this for like five minutes at some point and do nothing but move all my soldiers around. And it's going to be so boring. Um, that's okay. And then we'll park a blist in the middle. And then we'll put some towers around it. Okay, see now I'm happy with this and with this. Where are the areas that I'm not happy with? This is okay. This is still basically empty. What do things look like up here? I keep forgetting about this entire side of the map. <laughs> this is probably fine. This could use a blister or two in it. Again, just to make myself feel better. Like here, maybe. Yeah, and then I can put a wasp in there and stuff. Oh, speaking of which, I can't build my own wasps, can I? Do I need to research them, though? I've got 16 of the damn things. Here, just have another wasp. There. And it actually looks like I just need some ballista support around most of these areas. Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Just here to, you know, back up the towers. Because the towers, you know, have quite a long recharge time, so we want to make sure that, um, that we can cover them in between their enormous, like, crowd-clearing shots. They're amazing. I love watching them go. Reporting for duty. Okay. Who do you want me to punish? Okay, good. Oh, and we're down to 19 power again. Alright. Oh, can I upgrade the mills now? What do these cost to upgrade? Ooh, expensive. Um, do it anyway. It's actually not that bad. Two workers, 20 iron. Well, we have a lot of iron. Um, the money is actually the only factor. Um, by the way, I think that I'm going to wait, in case you're wondering why I'm not building this foundry. I think I'm going to wait until after this next wave, and then I'm going to properly, um, get everything researched. I think that's, I think that's the plan. You guys don't even have towers down here? Seriously? How did I miss that? Here, have some towers. You're going to need them. Alright, so the advanced mill is putting out 60 power, as opposed to the basic one, which is 30. Oh, that's pretty cool. I like that quite a bit. Alright, looking good. So we got three days left here. So, what to do in three days? Attention. Building complete. Yeah, this is looking pretty good. Okay, so I've had this paused for a bit, I think. So I have rebuilt the entrances over here. You'll notice there's now a shocking tower and a blista, and I did take out that farm. I could put some more defenses back here, but I'm not that worried about it at the moment. Um, I've got soldiers, I think, stationed all the way around. I've got... Shocking towers, I've got regular towers, there's no one standing around there, right? Okay, good. Um, I'm still a little worried about this area, that's not all that well defended. Um, this area is looking pretty good. I've been trying to put um, a sniper into every single tower, or, I'm sorry, in every single gap. So every area should have one, except for right here where there is nobody. Oh. Well, that's not ideal. Why don't you come over here? Um, and you can see I've done something very similar here. So, I think that will be okay. My problem with training soldiers at the moment is that I don't have any money. Um, ah, crap. Okay, coming from the north. Um, okay. So they're basically going to run directly back into where they were last time. That's okay. Yeah, that's just fine. Do we have anyone free around here that I can borrow? Not exactly, no. I mean, I can. Here, why don't some of you guys come up here? Um, I'm just bringing you guys because you're close. And th there is, frankly, a lot of backup for you, so it's okay. Um, so are you guys that have, you know, these other people watching your posts, 
That's okay if you come on up here. I mean, a shocking tower plus all that other stuff is probably fine. Okay, so. Yeah, you guys just come up here. I'm not actually sure where I'm going to put you all. Just shuffle your way on up here. Anyone else I really want to move? I've got 11 hours. Let's move the vets up here. Okay, honestly, this is already kind of dizzying. <laughs> I don't I don't even know where I put people or what they're doing or why. Um, everything's just very confusing to me at the moment. I do have a spare sniper um, who just got trained. You can come join the group up here. You'll be helpful. Actually, just come stand right around there. You'll actually be quite helpful. All right, and let's see what soldiers trickle their way up. I don't have time to build any more defenses, and honestly, I don't feel like I need them, although I guess we're about to find it out. It might have been nice to have another shocking tower, like over here, because this is where we had trouble last time. Oh, I'm out of workers, too. Well, that's cute. I didn't know that. Oh, obviously, I put in another bank, by the way. So, we've got another bank, because our income has dropped uh, precipitously. How's that for a good word? Luckily, I mean, I still have these guys. I can kind of stick some of these around. Yes. Well, I'd rather not. I guess. I guess. More soldiers. You guys are actually getting moved around to areas that are empty. So I'm not actually going to bring you up here. Like, that actually does need a soldier over there. Okay, so what do I have loose up here? Um... Not much, and I think I'm actually going to need you guys over here in these areas, because I think this is where the brunt of the attack is going to be, is in here. That's how it was last time, so I'm just assuming that that will be similar to this time. Okay, we got a couple more veterans coming, that's good. Try to load into this tower, although there won't be time. Alright, here we go. Well, this should be interesting. Got another vet or two. Just come over here. Yeah, just just do just do something. I don't I don't even know what. Just do something. Oh, they're all gonna come down here. Oh, they're all gonna come. Oh, all down here. Seriously. Hope they don't come around the corner. That could be pretty problematic. Okay. And I don't have my rangers outside to kite them. Ooh, this could be exciting. Really? Yeah, they're fine down there. I'm so not worried about them. Well, at least there is a shocking tower over here. You know what? I wonder if it's worth, like, the effort of bringing the rangers outside. Like, will you guys be able to move fast enough to get anything done? Come on, Shocking Towers, this is basically all you. Yeah. Yeah, they are. Oh, thank God for Shocking Towers. Oh, no, not you. Not you. I don't know who I selected. Um. Just, just, just stay wherever you are. There must be, like, some loose one around somewhere. Oh, here they are. Okay, good. Um... Yep, let's kite some of them back away. To give our defenses a chance to catch up. No! Not my units! Yeah, see, now we've had a chance to catch up. So now, now we're in good shape. I think I'm going to do this on a regular basis, because this is actually really good, is spreading out these waves. So our defenses are getting overwhelmed. Yeah, this is Deco's new plan that I probably should have figured out a long time ago. Yeah, this is a good plan. I like it. Now you guys can take care of this without any trouble whatsoever. Well, thanks to that and the Shocking Tower and just a whole bunch of manpower, we lost, like, what? One stone wall? Something like that? And some spike traps? Like, that worked out pretty well. That worked out better than I expected, I'm not gonna lie. Okay, but at this point, let's go ahead and let's take a break.
I'm pretty happy at how that went. So, as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.